so we discussed um, initial uh, EFI goals and uh, let's now go to current EFI goals and compare how it is different from from the initial goals. So first, a specification aims to define a complete solution for the firmware to describe all platform features and uh, provide that to operating system in coherent way. So the goal is to have one way to describe multiple platform designs. If we have multiple um, platform designs, um, those all, all those expose the platform defined features in the same way to operating to operating system or to um, bootloader. Second specification goal is to define interfaces to platform capabilities. Uh, those interfaces should simplify design and implementation of uh, the operating system uh, loaders, and uh, those also should provide stable boundary between uh, the platform um, hardware, firmware, and the operating system. So implementation do not exactly follow these goals because um, there is division. Uh, there is problem with the division of labor between oper operating system loader and the operating system uh, kernel. Kernel. We will discuss that later, um, especially in the boot device selection uh, boot stage, uh, where um, we will mention that. Uh, there is question who should call exit boot services function, but maybe right now this is too, too much detail. Um, third, um, reasonable device abstraction free of legacy interfaces. Um, this goal um, should make operating system loaders more portable uh, since its operation should be abstracted from specific hardware implementation. Um, we can install and boot most of, of the operating system right now on modern hardware. So it seems that this goal is uh, qu quite well implemented and quite quite well defined by Uf UFI forum. Uh, fourth goal, abstraction of option ROMs uh, from the firmware. Um, this goal leads to uh, defining in specification interfaces uh, that can abstract standard buses like uh, PCI, USB, SCSI, and um, Using those bus interfaces, um, there is a standard way to discover option ROMs and also a standard way to consume those and interact with them. Um, there is also this extensibility built into the specification because um, the abstraction for the bus itself, if there will be even ever growing uh, number of buses, um, is, is already in the specification, so there is no problem with adding new uh, new buses. Um, yeah, so this these goals lead to better consumption of option ROMs and better discovery, this discoverability and execution of those. So last goal, arch architecturally shareable system partition uh, led to creation of additional partition to hold software that can be uh, used by firmware. Uh, so this te technique creates uh, not so constrained uh, space on the on the hard disk, um, so the space is not so constrained in comparison to SPA flash uh, size, um, and th this this hard disk partition um, can deliver us a software that can be consumed by firmware. Uh, so we typically use that for um, for bootloader, for operating system kernel, uh, for RAM disk. And and various other um, shareable um, binaries, shareable software that can be used that can be consumed by firmware. Um, also, this partition can be used for firmware update. So definitely, this was an uh, interesting uh, goal uh, which was already achieved and and probably um, can be leveraged for various extension of the UFI specification. Um, it is worth to mention that um, specification one to or, or specification authors claim to um, follow the evolutionary, not revolutionary um, uh, approach. Um, so they anticipate long transition between um, between one version and another, between the features and between um, extensions of the specification. Uh, the, their main goal is to maintain current uh, partners advantage. So whatever ecosystem was built so far, it, it should be maintained. And uh, they want to have comp compatibility by design. 
um, of course, this led uh, this lead to um, creating fun functions with the uh, number at the end. So, for example, we have uh, various functions which end with uh, two, three, uh, because there are new versions of those functions. Uh, and for uh, compatibility, the older one are left uh, in the spec. And um, then uh, the, the other goal is to uh, simplify addition of OS neutral platform uh, value added software. So this is this, this shareable partition helps with that. Um, and of course, this is also needed for the for the partners for the ecosystem that was already built by um, UFI forum members or before even by EFI um, creators. Um, and uh, they also don't want to throw away whatever was built so far. So they don't want to um, waste uh, already spent money uh, and want to continue some some um, ideas which are in the ecosystem which may be good, may be bad, depending on the directions and de depending on the what really uh, features are blocked in, in long run. Um, yeah, so the minimalism of the interfaces is quite far from reality right now uh, because uh, um, it's very hard to create a wide range of support, flexible support um, when we uh, uh, claim to have minimal interfaces. So either we have wide range of support with um, with flexible interfaces, either we have minimal interfaces.